that I own, it's from Earthwise. This is our eight amp corded adjustable pole chainsaw. Um, anything you need to reach to cut, you can reach with this because the pole extends. It's not scary, it's not intimidating, it's easy to use. Um, it is only uh, nine pounds is all it weighs. It uses a traditional bar and chain, the same kind that would be on a regular full out chainsaw, but it's compact and it's portable. Plug it in, works on electric power, and you will be amazed at what you can cut. You can do small firewood, you can do trees, limbs, branches. There's no ridiculous noise, there's no fumes, and nothing cuts like a pole saw, especially this one because the end articulates. Let the weight of the saw do the cutting. I own this, my, in fact, my brother sent me pictures yesterday. He's up in Vermont, he's got a house up there and his apple tree fell over. He was out there cutting up all the apple trees into branches to use his firewood next season. So I love it. I think everybody should use one. It's feature price at only $76.50. And my good buddy, Peter Kilcullen, is Peter Skyping or calling? Oh, he's Skyping. My bro, <laughs> Peter Kilcullen. Hey, buddy, welcome to the show. Hey, guys. How's it going? <laughs> good, good. Tell everybody about this pole saw, will you? Oh, well, I know you love the pole saw, but everyone will as well. And something you said was great is that this is definitely the pole saw for people who never thought they could use either a pole saw or a chainsaw. Not intimidating at all, super easy to use. And check this out. It will extend to over nine feet, but weighs nine pounds. So anybody can handle this. So I think you're gonna really love that part about it. You talked about the 10 inch bar and chain. When we talk about a 10 inch bar and chain, it means that you're gonna be able to handle larger limbs. So if you wanna cut firewood and you want it to be six or seven inches in diameter, we're gonna be able to do that. And that Oregon bar and chain, as you mentioned, industry standard, so you're absolutely gonna love that because it's gonna make those cuts easy. You're not gonna have to be holding on to the saw for dear life. It's gonna do the job for you. It's gonna make it easy. All you're doing is adding your extension cord and you can start working. And this is the time to do it, guy, to get out there at the start of spring and get rid of all those branches, all those dead limbs. And this is the way to do it with the Earthwise pole saw, for sure. I love it. I mean, you know, for me, <laughs> It's an easy, easy fix to any issue that you have where well, you've got trees or limbs or branches. Like, I know a lot of people have, um, you know, trees that hang over their driveway, Pete. And that's, right. how else are you going to get rid of that? You got to go out there and, and, you know, people get on a ladder with a handsaw. And I'm like, man, you are rolling the dice doing stuff like that. You don't have to do that when you have a pole saw. I'm going to show everybody um, basically how it's set up. I've got mine in front of me right here. Um, and this is, um, th this, is th this is exactly the one that I have. Mine's an older model but this is it. Um, easy to handle. As Pete said, it only weighs about nine pounds. You can extend the pole in the middle so that you'll get extra reach. You never have to get on a ladder with this thing. All right, regular bar and chain down here. We have ours covered, but you can see easy, easy to, to utilize. And it gives you an idea of how much cutting you can do. So you can do branches that are pretty big right here. So if you need to do uh, small firewood, you can do that as well. On top, there's one little thing that you do and you take this lid off. And this is where you put your bar and chain oil. I'll open that up and you put a little bit in. You can find that in any hardware store and you can order it online. That basically lubricates the chain as it circulates inside. So it allows a little oil to hit this uh, and that makes it run nice and smooth. This button here is how you articulate it when you wanna move it um, and bend it into an angle. There you go, just like that. Now all you do is you allow the, the saw and the, and the angle of the saw that do all the work. That'll lock back in straight, just like that. Um, you, you extend it in the center and then all you need to do is get yourself um, you know, a, an extension cord. But Peter, I tell you, one of the greatest things I've ever bought. It's easily in the top five of anything I've ever purchased at HSN in my 20 years because right. it's so reliable. I don't have to pull start it. I don't have to put gas in it. And it's instant on, it turns off when you release the trigger. It's safe to use. You have that double locking mechanism. Anybody right. out there can use it. You know, Peter, it's funny because most of our callers and people that write in are women that are like, you know what, I'm, 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 I'm home alone and I wanna be able to do stuff and I don't wanna have to hire somebody. Cause you know, Peter here in Florida, they charge you 50 bucks a tree, <laughs> right? Oh yeah, it can get expensive really quick. And what's so great about having the pole saw is exact, exactly what you said, that anyone can use this. But think about it, if you were to walk outside the house right now, it's obviously raining here, you would see a lot of branches outside your house. The ones that are getting too close to the cars in the driveway, maybe pushing up against a window or the roof. 
you would find that most of those branches are only gonna be about eight or nine feet, 10 feet at the most, and you're gonna be able to do all of those. You mentioned without a ladder, and at nine pounds and extending over nine feet. So imagine if you're if you're from five feet tall to six feet tall and you extend this out an additional nine feet, those branches are easily you know, in reach for you to cut down and it's not something you're gonna have to pay someone else to do. You are gonna love it. And you mentioned how easy it is. Again, plug it in and it's going to fire up right away. You let go, it stops. There's not that constant noise. And there certainly is all the hassle of trying to start a gas power chainsaw. And you and I talk about this all the time. They're just so much more intimidating. They're more than you need. Yeah. This I think is the perfect tool for the jobs that we have to do at home. Yeah, and you're gonna use it for everything. I mean, I use it here and, and I've talked to Peter about this. I use it because here we have our palm fronds which grow up on the tree and then they eventually fall off. When I got up this morning, there was one laying next to my car. I'm pretty sure it hit my car and I don't even want to think about that until I get out of work. But if you don't trim those down, they're going to eventually wind up on your driveway. They're going to wind up on your car. They're going to wind up on your house. And then you got to worry about getting on a ladder. What's so nice about this saw, you never have to get on a ladder. You have the extra extension of, uh, Peter, what does it extend? It's like an extra eight or nine feet, right? Well, it'll go all the way up to nine feet, three nine inches feet. in length. Yeah. yeah. So you got plenty of reach. There's no instruction manual really needed. All you need to do is plug one end in. You, you'll see when you grab the handle how you have to depress the buttons on the side and squeeze. So that's a safety right. mechanism. And then you're going to go to town. As much as you loved our pressure washer for cleaning, you will love this for cleaning up your yard work because I use it, and Pete, you can use this on anything. You know how cool it was last uh, holiday when I could trim my own Christmas tree? I was like, <laughs> nice. I need to take another couple inches off the tree. I got a pole saw. I don't have to be out there with a handsaw. I mean, it's like day and night between using a handsaw and using this. I actually think this is safer because it's more controlled. Sure, and it does the job, right? We, you know, we talk sometimes we're in the kitchen that you want to have a sharp knife because that's going to be safer than a dull knife. That's exactly what this is. This is the right tool to cut those branches, whether it's a, a one inch in diameter all the way up to seven, eight inches in diameter, it's going to be able to do the job. But I wanted to talk to everyone about when they're going to use their pole saw. Certainly right now, as the weather's warming, we're going to be outside. You want to take care of all those branches from the winter. Maybe they've really gotten overgrown. Maybe there's dead limbs. Maybe there's down branches. Remember, this allows you to get all those limbs that are already fallen, cut them to the proper length, either get rid of them or use them for firewood. But then think about this. After the summer is a perfect time to start using it again. Maybe late fall to make sure we don't have any of those branches that are going to cause damage when we have the winter storms, the heavy snow. So think about that, that you're going to be using this many times throughout the year, and it's going to be there for you because it's so simple to use. Lightweight, really long reach. If you've never used a chainsaw or a pole saw, this is going to be the perfect option. Yeah, you're, you're going to love it. And, and again, you have 90 days to use it. So wow. yeah, they get to use it all the rest of April, all of May, all of June, and most of July to try it out. Because I know a lot of people, Peter, get are a little intimidated still. Get it home. All right, I, I mean, honestly, my brother never thought he'd own a chainsaw. When he when I told him about mine, he bought one. He's, he's bought two. He's got one up at his Vermont house because he's, it, trees and branches are always coming down up there from the severe weather. And then he's got one at his house in Connecticut. And he's like, you can't afford, afford to not get this. It saves you so much time and money. And think about it, you know, a big old branch on your house that you could reach and you could cut off before it gets in your house makes life easier. You have lots of reach and access with this. It's never been easier. And I think for people that are a little bit nervous, Pete, they need to try it. Yeah, exactly. If you've never used a pole saw, you've never used a chainsaw, go with this. You will be amazed at how easy it is. The first time you use it, you're gonna be saying, wait, Man, that was a lot easier than I thought. Lots of control. You're never going to feel out of control using it. Get out there and cut those branches. You're going to save a lot of money, and your outside, outside environment is going to look really, really nice. Except I love for a it. day like this, guy. A little too rainy today. Yeah, I know. It is. <laughs> it's it's, it's kind of it's messing things up, but it's all good. Peter, thank you, buddy. Appreciate you for Skyping Thanks, in. Thanks, guy. See you soon, Great pal. Great to see you. All right, man. So, hey, listen, really quick, everybody. Our today's special still a